Hello YouTube. Well, I was trying to see how um how to make a uh, seaweed fertilizer, and I I was seeing that they kind of make they make it out of fresh seaweed out of the sea, or they buy it. So I bought some seaweed for like three bucks, and this is to make sushi. But the only thing I don't know is this right here that is roasted. Roasted to seaweed, so I don't know if that's gonna work, but. At Petco, at Petco, or the Petco, um, they uh, have seaweed for like fishes, and that's like raw seaweed, but it's just dried. And, but it costs like four bucks, and it's probably like, whatever I got in this pack, it's half of it. <coughs> and four bucks worth, so that's the reason I, w I went at this store. You get, you get this at a Walmart, a uh, Safeway, or any Asian store, and just look for it. And this is what I, this is the one I got, but I don't know if it's gonna work because of that. Well, this is roasted, so I don't know if it kills anything or I don't know, but I'm gonna try it out. But yeah, check out stuff, check stuff out on YouTube about how to make fertilizer, uh, seaweed fertilizer. And uh, I think the best method would be just to do you, you yourself go to the go to the beach and get some seaweed and dry it out, or uh, yeah, I guess dry it out or like. Just like how you get it and just mix it in a blender. So this is what you get. I already have some pieces here. You see? I don't know if you can see that. And I have some already that I already, um, I already blended and put it in, put in water. So and the water I have, it's uh, distilled water. So I won't have any chlorine or anything like that. So here it goes. This is uh, I break. I actually tore it up into little pieces, but like how it's just, I just got, I'm using one hand for the camera and one hand for this. But yeah, but I broke it up into little pieces. I'm putting it in there. Now I'm going to get my water. So this is distilled water, okay? It's not water out of the faucet. And just throw it in there. Right there. Uh, da -da. And I just put the cap on here and ready to blend. it on uh, chop and then cl and clear and then blend uh, first I had it on blend and then chop and clear and all that all right so that's how it looks after it's been all chopped up and then I got my little funnel that I made out of a Pepsi bottle and it smells like fish oh so And some of that red stuff, I could like rinse it out with like some more of that water, but I don't got any more. And I don't want to put no chlorine water in here. So that's how it looks. Yeah. And I'm gonna, do, when I do my compost tea, I'm gonna, probably, I'm gonna mix this up into it. I'm just experimenting. I don't know if it's gonna help it out or anything, but I don't think it will. I don't think I'll mess it up neither. Oh yeah. And that's the sea that's the seaweed package I got it off. And uh, yeah. And I got some seaweed extract. This right here. I'm gonna probably put it in here too. It's actually kelp extract. I'm gonna probably put it mix it in there too. Uh I'll probably help it out, but I don't know. See what happens.
Alright. I'm mixing it all in there. So yeah, that's my seaweed extract and and my seaweed fertilizer I'm doing. And this is the extract. And I'll put it in there. So when I mix it up, it's, uh, when I mix it up with my uh, compost tea, I'm gonna probably put a little bit on it, like uh, two cups per gallon or something. But yeah, I'm gonna let it right there, pop out. I'm gonna let it right there, and I'm gonna leave it here, and I'm gonna just gonna, gonna be using it with my tea, my compost tea. But I heard you could put this straight without, like without this, just that you could just put it onto your plants, any plants you want, and I think it'll, it'll like give it good food. So there is YouTube and hopefully I keep up keep on put updating more videos of my of my plants and the fertilizer methods I'm doing. Thank you. And please keep watching more videos.